Well, Chris, that was a very impressive 3-0 win against a very good side. You must be quite happy with that, especially that second clean sheet in a row. Well, yeah, I, I think I think in the first half, the game was pretty even in terms of possession. Um, I was dis disappointed with some of the choices that we made when we were going forward and some of the passing that we did when we were going forward. But we, we managed to get 1-0 um, uh, up from a set piece, which we've been working on, which was quite pleasing for us. Yeah. Um, in the second half, when the game got a bit stretched, and actually I think when we lost uh, Matty Quirk through uh, a little bit of a reckless uh, goalkeeping error, then when he got sent off and the game opened up uh, with more space, I think that suited us more than them, especially with the pace of our players getting in behind. And in particular, Lee Gale was making some great runs down the right-hand side and then swapping Charlie for Simo, Simo's pace got him inside the defender and you know got him got himself a great goal yeah but Lee Gale put in two or three you know fantastic crosses so I think the space has suited us more than them yeah I mean the quality of the goals stands out for me tonight Sean Doyle's second goal was yeah. exceptional yeah. that, that you know to keep the ball to keep the ball down in that kind of finish yeah. that was that was a brilliant goal yeah, and Daniel was quite composed when he Opportunity yeah, well. I, just, I just think you know the clean sheet. The clean sheet means a lot, you know, to me. It should mean a lot more to the defence. And two in a row now, it's it's pretty unheard of for us. But there's bigger games to come, Cheadle Town next week. But we can only do what we're doing, and, and we we can still improve. We, we talked about it at half time. I wasn't happy with our first half performance. In all fairness, yeah. I think we can play a lot better than we did. Yeah. Um, we played we we played a lot better in the second half. We were a little bit more direct with our passing and our and getting in behind them and getting some decent crosses in so i think at the end of the day when you look at it and it's uh, like you say two clean sheets in a row we move further ahead of the teams that are chasing us so we're trying to consolidate that uh, playoff place as soon as we can um yeah i think that puts us one point behind abby hay are in third and two points behind new mills that are in second but i think new mills have a couple of games in hand so mm. It's still there to play for. I think I think there's still at least 12 games to go. I'm there is, that's sure. like 26 yeah. games. We've got yeah. 12 to play. Withenshaw dropped points again today. So that yeah. helps us. Well, we're four points ahead of them now with a game in hand. Yeah. So, and we're also, I think it's something like eight points ahead of Cheadle Town with a game in hand. So that, that's pretty promising, but we still need to improve. We still need to get better, you know, for the complete running for the season. Absolutely. So, but I think we can all enjoy, everyone at the club can enjoy tonight's win. Yeah, I think everyone should be really pleased and uh, yeah, can't wait till next week now. Well done Chris, enjoy the night. Thank you very much.